Dearly beloved, we are gathered here in the sight of God and in the presence of these witnesses to join together Keith and Kim in holy matrimony. This is an honorable estate instituted by God and signifying unto us the mystical union which exists between Christ and his church. It is therefore not to be entered into unadvisedly, but reverently, discreetly, and with the approval of God. It is into this holy estate these two persons come now to be joined. You may be seated. These are the very hands that will passionately love you and cherish you through the years, and with the slightest touch will comfort you like no other. These are the hands that will hold you when fear or grief threatens to overwhelm you. The hands that you hold are the same hands that will countless times wipe tears from your eyes, tears of sorrow and tears of joy. These two are the hands that will tenderly hold your children and help you to hold your family together as one. And lastly, these are the hands that even when wrinkled and aged will still be reaching for yours, still giving you the same unspoken tenderness with just a touch. And Keith, you're going to be first. Okay. <clears throat> I, Keith, I'll hold it for you. All right. All right. I, Keith, take I you, Keith, Kim. Do take Kim. To be my wedded wife. To be my wedded wife. To have and to hold from this day forward. To have and to hold from this day forward. For better, for worse. For better, for worse. For richer, for poor. For richer, for poor. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. As long as we both shall live. As long as we both shall live. Kim. It's now your turn. <laughs> I, Kim, take you, Keith. I, Kim, take you, Keith. To be my wedded husband. To be my wedded husband. To have and to hold from this day forward. To have and to hold from this day forward. For better, for worse. For better, for worse. For richer, for poor. For richer, for poor. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. As long as we both shall live. As long as we both shall live. I hold in my hand two beautiful rings. They are made of precious metal, representing the two precious lives that stand before me. Each ring has no beginning and no end, representing the eternal nature of true love. May they be given and received to remind you both that your love is never ending. Keith, would you place this ring on Kim's finger? Hold it there. Look at her and repeat after me. In token and pledge, in token and pledge of my constant faith, of my constant faith and abiding love, and abiding love with this ring, with this ring, I thee wed, I thee wed. And Kim, would you place this ring on Keith's finger? Hold it there. Look at him and repeat after me. In token and pledge, in token and pledge of my constant faith, of my constant faith and abiding love, and abiding love with this ring, with this ring, I thee wed, I thee wed. And Keith and Kim, the pledge and the vows that you have just made with each other are a relationship pledge, and the sand ceremony is a great illustration of what the two of you are doing today. As each of your individual containers of sand are poured into the center container, the grains of sand will be combined never to be divided again. And may your love also never be divided. For as much as Keith and Kim have consented together in holy wedlock and have witnessed the same before God and this company and thereto have pledged their faith each to the other and have declared the same by joining hands and by giving and receiving rings, I pronounce that they are husband and wife together in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Those whom God has joined together, let man not put asunder. Amen. Keith, yep. you may kiss your beautiful bride. <laughs> if you want to turn your face and hold it. Ladies and gentlemen, 
Mr. and Mrs. Keith McCarthy.